It's the year 2040, 2043. Oh. Alex, Mur- Alex Murphy is in, <laughs> is in the line of duty. He gets killed, and now he's a robo. Robot man. <laughs> it was going to be Robo Top. <laughs> I didn't have time to write the synopsis, but it's Robo. That's so good. Wow, yeah. Robo Top. So I guess I have an idea. Um, so here's a question: yeah. uh, In that timeline, does does OCP make? Do they make good lube or <laughs> the best? Oh. You can you can slide Alex. Through di- you can slide through dimensions with <laughs> lube. Whoa, it's Alex Murphy approved. Is it really oily? I hate oily lube. That's gross. Uh, he, like a water based. Yeah, I need water based. Yeah, like toy friendly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's fine. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay. Okay. That was, well, that that's that. that. Wow. You just want to know a weird thing you, I've been doing lately? Be thankful if this is an audio only format. <laughs> you just want to know a weird thing I've been doing lately? Uh, jail King? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> what have you been doing? I'm going to fucking Google it. What have you been doing? What's a weird thing you've been doing? <laughs> Why did you bring that up? What is it? Just. I, it's. <laughs> I don't even know how to spell it. J E L Q I N G? Jelky? Wait, J E. Oh, there we go. He was right. It's a it's penis just... stretching exercise that involves massaging your penis tissues, stretching the skin to create micro tears that look engorged when they heal. Yeah, you gotta. Well, it's not as bad as I thought it was. Well, you, just, sometimes you gotta do that thing where you make your, your shmeat pop, you know what I mean? But that can give you ED, so you gotta be careful. <laughs> I'm just scared now. I've just I've been listening to <laughs> Legend by Bob Marley and the Whalers. It's the whole album. Classic, classic. A lot. Never listened to it. And it's so oh, fucking really? weird wow. that I've been doing it because I haven't listened to that in years. Oh. Remember when I used to walk around and be like, yeah, Bob Marley's my shit. And, yeah, like, and then you've never listened to Legend. <laughs> I've never listened to it. I don't know. That it's is such weird. a good album. Are you are you big so into good. reggae? No, I fucking hate oh, reggae. Oh wow. Mm-hmm. It's like like I like virtually any genre of music, but but not reggae. I can't fucking do reggae. And I think it's just because white suburban kids ruined reggae. Oh, no, definitely. <laughs> um like white mm. suburban kids talking about how Ja saved their life and <laughs> Ja hey, this and, That's on Ja, like, dude. No, on you ja. fucking just smoke a bunch of weed and fucking steal other people's culture, you fucking yeah. Hippie piece of shit. Hey, man, I was in my mom's basement listening to Black Uruhu. Or however you say that. Um, hey, love Selassie, man. <laughs> Life is true. <laughs> White suburban kids ruined reggae. That's all, I, that's all I have to say about it. Way to go. Way to go. Sorry. My bad. White suburban God, that sounds like everything. a great, like, Dead Kennedys track. White, White suburban, suburban kids, kids ruined reggae. reggae. Oh, yeah. White suburban kids. But it would be like Dead Kennedys featuring Tim Armstrong for some fucking reason. Mm. And it would just be a reggae song by White <laughs> Suburban Kids. Well, I, I, speaking of funny enough, I went to see uh, Jello Biafra and the Guantanamo School mm-hmm. of Medicine a couple years ago, and it, it wasn't as fun as I thought it was. No. <laughs> it was a lot of ham-fisted politics talks. Like, yeah, that's that's Jello. <laughs> listen, Jello, we're here to listen to you say like three songs <laughs> and then go home, <laughs> you old shit. <laughs> He's still reputable, though. Oh, sure, but I'm not going to a punk show to listen to wealth disparity and... I mean, in a way, in a roundabout way, I am. Yeah, I, it, nah. needs to be, it needs to be sung to me, not spoken to me. Yes. If yeah. you wanted to go to a political fucking rally, you would do so. Exactly. Yeah. You know. Hey, Steve, what'd you do this week? Anything fun? Anything good? Um, while well, I stayed in a hotel and I realized that there is some truth in that whole. Oh, are you a doctor? No, but I did stay in a Holiday Inn Express last night. <laughs> because. <laughs> What the fuck did you just say? <laughs> oh, shit. Wow. Because I did not stay in a Holiday Inn Express, and I think next time I will. They're nice. Oh, were you only in like a regular Holiday Inn? No, I was at a Comfort Inn, which it was comfortable. Mm-hmm. Did you get oh. But it wasn't like Express. Oh. Did you get a free continental breakfast when you went Oh, there? do you want to fucking talk about the breakfast? Was it good? Did you have a mint on it your pillow? I don't know. I can't that. tell. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so, you know, the thing, it says, like, breakfast is served from 6.30 a.m. to 9.30 a.m. Yeah. And, like, I stayed up and drank a few beers, and I watched, like, 
300 channels of TV all at once because I just channel surfed. Wow. I, I don't have cable or anything. So channel surfing is kind of a novelty for me, you know, and it was a lot of fun. Devin and I, we, we flipped through <laughs> channels and we laughed. We'd watch like a minute of something. And then right as it got crazy, we'd be like, oh, fuck, that's crazy. And then we'd watch something else. <laughs> Wow. That's so so I woke up at like nine o'clock. I was like, ooh, I'm gonna go down and make sure I get some breakfast before they end it at nine thirty. Mm. And I go downstairs and like I'm walking down this long hallway, which is like creepy fucking hallway that goes on forever. And they have a door and it's the put in bay room. And it mm. says breakfast hours, oh. six thirty to nine thirty. And I try to open the door and the door is locked. <gasps> and by the way, it's nine oh five, so definitely within breakfast <clears throat> hours. No. So a kind gentleman was like, oh, breakfast is in the lobby. I'm like, oh, okay, that's weird, but I'll walk down there. So I walk down to the lobby. And I look around and I don't see any fucking breakfast. Oh. And I'm like, the guy behind the counter is like, oh, good morning. I'm like, hey, man. <laughs> Not even a good morning, man. <laughs> I'm looking for breakfast. And as that- I look over, they have like a little coffee bar, which is like a coffee machine and some cups. <laughs> And next to it are like 20 brown paper bags lined up. Oh, Aww. I'm like, is that breakfast? Yes. He's like, yeah. It's bologna on white crust cut off. With it was yellow mustard. In each, in each bag, <laughs> there was slice of American one on the side. bottle Ooh. of water. Yes. Wait, wait. Full size or a little baby? Uh, like a, a half liter, 500 milliliter. Oh, wow. Like 16.9. <laughs> yeah. You know, the kind you get the 24 pack for $3. Yeah, yeah sure, sure. Um, one bottle of water. two sixty nine if you're lucky. One Clementine Little Mini Orange. Oh, wow. One granola bar and two peppermints. Wow, what what a great you, breakfast. Peppermint for breakfast. Are they going to Oh Boys? I was very disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> Look, like, uh, like three weeks ago or whenever it was, I stayed at a Holiday Inn Express. Um they had a full breakfast. You could like get omelets made to order. Nice, sick. Wow. That's hot. Fucking sick. The next time, I'm definitely staying at a Holiday Inn Express. Yeah, please yeah, do yeah. so. Are you a doctor? No, but I didn't stay at Holiday Inn Express last night either. <laughs> so. I'm sorry. Oh, I guess I'm shit out of luck. Not looking good for you. Damn. Well, I um, guess I'm gonna die then. And then I went to Cedar Point. Oh, nice. wow, that was good. What'd you do? Did you do anything fun at Cedar Point? Um, I rode Steel Vengeance. Yeah. How was that? Oh, wow. that is my favorite coaster. Yeah. It's so good. Yeah. It's so good. Yeah. Um, and then we walked around and we drank uh, hot jack o' lantern juice, which was bewitched, <laughs> using oh. their terms, with a. Uh, it said it was Fireball Cinnamon Whiskey, but they actually <laughs> used Jack Daniel's yeah. Cinnamon Whiskey. Um, with, That's cheating. With, with or without mm-hmm. the... Uh, it also makes the drink more expensive. The antifreeze. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. Um, it was hot and it was tasty. Mm-hmm. Uh, but it came at a huge premium. <laughs> it was not cheap. Um, Nine seventy five for a five ounce fucking cup. Oh, mm-hmm. uh, they were big cups, actually. They were um, like big... Tall boy coffee cups, big gulps, big gulps. and uh, <laughs> they were like eleven bucks a piece. Um, when Seven Eleven b- bought Cedar Point, hot, yeah, I'm about it. But they were tasty. Uh, sometimes they had cinnamon sticks in them. Gulps. Oh wow! Sometimes they had cinnamon sticks in them. Yeah, not Was every that time. at the discretion of the bartender? Yeah, I guess. How many of these were one, you yeah. drinking? <laughs> uh, well, I had two, and Devin had two. Oh, okay. I couldn't imagine being at Cedar Point being. Uh, bewitched as as per their terms <laughs> uh, it would end bad well yeah we actually only rode steel vengeance as the only ride we rode. <laughs> oh um the it big, is halloween you mean you didn't get well you didn't they didn't do weekends this year uh because well, okay. of everything they, yeah. they're doing a fall festival uh-huh. um and they had a a bruise and booze special <laughs> thing going on Ooh. oh 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 bruise like like the drink, I thought it was like. <laughs> no, you have to ride the. You just have to ride the corkscrew thirty times in a row and here's see your, how many bruises you get. Here's your beer, <laughs> and here's your complimentary uh, CTE from corkscrew. So is it? So is it like, like how Tony Hawk did the kickflip McTwist with the cup of milk in his hand? Oh yeah. Do you have to? Yeah, it was yeah, recent. Yeah. It was what? real mm-hmm. recent. Uh, he did a fucking McTwist with a cup of milk in his hand. It didn't spill. Hey, Google dry. pulled that video. Sponsored by McDonald's, the McTwist. No, that's his one of his special yeah. moves. Do you guys remember when Tony Hawk um, 
did a 900 over the entirety of New York City to get the secret tape. <laughs> that was fucking sick, dude. He actually did two. Oh, he had time to no, two. Excuse yeah. me, I'm sorry. Was that in Tony Hawk 5? Yes. Yes. Uh, but, yeah. American is Wasteland. That, is <laughs> fun, too. No, there, there's a Tony Hawk 5. Oh, uh, I know. It I exists. Yeah. I don't know why. Uh, I've never played it. Me, Eric Sparrow, that bastard. Eric Sparrow. <laughs> Motherfucker. Uh, Motherfucker. But yeah. I'm going to go to Hawaii and did, whoop his ass. Did they give you like a beer and say if you can survive the corkscrew once without <laughs> spilling a drop of beer? Oh. Oh. You well, don't get anything due to but the centripetal beer. motion, whatever. You should oh, be able I to didn't. do that. I didn't do that, no. Oh, they oh, also oh. had uh, tricks and treats food specials. What? So we just walked around and drank our alcohol and got snacks from a bunch of different places. What did we get? Oh. What did we get when we went there last time? Oh, was it some kind of? I got a burrito. I think. I thought we got the burrito. Wow! Yeah, burrito. and there was a heart attack wrap that I almost got, heart which was chicken wrap. tenders, fries, mac and cheese, oh. and ranch. You mean you wrapped did, up you, in a tortilla? Oh, you mean oh. you didn't get a giant melt sandwich and try to fucking enjoy yourself the rest of the oh, time? Oh, I ate there? melt this week also. Oh, melt. Wow. What'd you have? Um, I got the dude abides. Oh, okay. yeah, That's a solid. Good one. Solid choice. And uh, Devin one. got the TMNT. Oh, that's all right. Also, good. Um, I wasn't crazy about it when I last time I had it. I think that like, I don't know, pizza rolls. Honestly, yeah. but they're just they're cheese pizza rolls. Like it's Which not are the like, worst yeah. pizza. Yeah, rolls. honestly, the Give thing me a that supreme made the, at least. Fuck, you make it up a notch. Oh yeah, was that oh, basil gotcha. sauce? Um, the basil sauce, the pesto. Yeah, they're well. I don't know if it was pesto because it was like a basil tomato sauce. Because the last I knew it was supposed to be like a basil, a basil pesto aioli. You know, oh, maybe shit. that's what it is. I don't know. We actually got it Uber Eats delivered. Oh, that sucks. Um, and I was legitimately impressed. Yeah? Yeah. You know, I'm thinking like, oh, by the time it gets here, it's going to be like soggy and not that good. It was hot. Uh, our bread was still crispy. It was hot and it was ready. Yep. What's up? We actually got it from Little Caesars. <laughs> and to top it off, I had a $30 off Uber Eats coupon. Ooh. Ooh. So we paid like $11, thrifty. including our tip, to have ah, two melt sandwiches. Very together. frugal. I like that. The top. Yeah, that was good. That was real good. Frugality gets me going. I've never <laughs> seen. Hell yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> it gets you going like it gets Levi going. Hey, nothing, nothing, <laughs> gives me a, nothing gives me a chubby more than like. Big savings. I've never had Uber Eats experience before, so that was oh. nice. Levi doesn't need the Pornhub app. He's just got, let me, or you need a budget. I just got, <laughs> yeah, I watch uh, Extreme Couponers and just, that's it. <laughs> <I'm sad. laughs> Woo! So you're a financial filiac. Wow. Yes, but not like in the fin dom way. Okay. I'd be a fin dom, not a fin sub. Okay. I, I don't have enough money to do that. Okay. Well, yeah. <laughs> I'd be a subway sub. Oh. Damn. Damn. Um, chicken bacon ranch. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Yo. Can I take a bite, please? please uh, <laughs> Melt's got corn dogs on their fucking menu saw, now? On their happy hour menu? Wow. I had a corn dog. Those look like some... Big battered corn. And like we, during when the Indians make it to the World Series, they oh, do their oh. they bring back their corny beast, That's which is boy. two jumbo all beef hot dogs, American cheese on their bread on a cornbread bun, battered in a cornbread batter with a stick in it, and then they serve it with fucking stadium mustard, oh, and it's just a fucking giant corn dog, and it's so fucking good. So the Indians. You better fucking step your game up. <laughs> yeah, let's go. <laughs> Next season, you better bring it. Need to see um, some hustle out there, boys. Yeah. Guys, I did one other thing that was real different. Ooh, tell us. Oh. I sat at a bar yesterday. The wines would come kick your ass. Um, it was all right. Uh, I We went to the foundry and ordered food to go and sat at the bar and drank beer <gasps> until it was ready. Oh, sick. Yeah. What'd pretty. you drink? Um, it was a rusty rail. Hold on, <laughs> rusty Whoa. rail. <laughs> I asked what you drank, not what you and Devin got into afterwards. So rusty, <laughs> rusty trombone. It was rusty rail waffle sauce, Ooh. which is a maple pecan imperial brown ale. That sounds fucking. And it was delicious. real good. Oh, it does. Oh my god, it, it sounds good. very sexual too, and I like it. it. That's a beer that I would drink with a boner. Well, I drank two of them. With, With a, a boner? boner? <clears throat> Come over here and find out. <laughs> <laughs> this, is a, this is truly a saucy episode. Oh, yeah. 
This episode is brought to you by Sauce. <laughs> the Oregon Trail. Get that wagon <laughs> off my face. <laughs>